Toshidaiji is a Buddhist temple in Noro, Japan. The historical significance and value of this temple is beyond comparison. The founder of the temple is the Chinese Buddhist monk Qianzhen, who dedicated his life to the study and practice Buddhism. At age of 66 he arrived in Japan and began his journey of teaching Buddhism. In a time of thriving Buddhist culture, many notable monks emerged, but only Jinjin's tomb has been continuously revered and worshipped by people for more than 1,200 years after his passing. In this video we will discover the history of Toshidai Temple and the story of Jinjin. Jinjin was a Chinese Buddhist monk born in 688 in Yongju, China. He became a monk at a young age. In 733, he became the local Buddhist leader and abbot of the Da Ming Temple. Over 40,000 people received ordination from him, and he was praised by his contemporaries as the leader of enlightenment in the region. In 742, Japanese monks Yoei and Fosho visited the Da Ming Temple and beseeched the monks to venture to Japan and transmit the Buddhism in the country. The monks said, the country is too far away. We will die on the way to travel to Japan. Nevertheless, Jinjin said, this is a matter to spread Buddhist teachings. If no one will go, I will go myself. In 743, Jinjin first attempted to travel to Japan. However, his efforts were thwarted when he encountered a series of adversities, including adverse weather conditions and shipwrecks. Undeterred, he made four more attempts in the next 11 years, each time facing challenges that prevented him from reaching Japan. In 748, during the fifth unsuccessful attempt traveling to Japan, he even lost his eyesight. Despite all life-threatening adversities he finally crossed the ocean and arrived in Noro in 754. After his arrival in Japan, Ganjin dedicated the rest of his life to teaching and spreading Buddhist wisdom, as well as training Japanese monks in the Vinaya rules and rituals. He founded the temple Toshidaiji in Noro in 759, becoming a central figure in the development of Buddhism in Japan. In the ten years until his death in Japan, Jinjin not only propagated the Buddhist faith among the aristocracy, but also served as an important conductor of Chinese culture. His dedication to Buddhism and his unwavering commitment to his mission have made him an iconic and inspirational figure in the history of Buddhism in Japan. Jinjin passed away in 763 at age of 76. Jinjin's disciples, foreseeing his death, had made a statue of him, presently a national treasure, constructed using the hollow core dry lacquer technique. Now this is enshrined in the Meodu Hall of the Toshidai Temple which is open to the public for just several days a year, including June 6 and also the day before and after. It is surely an inspiring experience to stand before and behold this magnificent statue. A visit to Toshidaiji Temple is an opportunity to connect with the profound cultural heritage and find inner peace in this sacred place. You can come and be part of the timeless legacy that Jinjin left behind at Toshidaiji Temple.